everyone. Happy Halloween. Um, we are going to jump right into our warm up. I'll explain the workout and then we will get our monster mash on today. All right, so to start, let's go ahead and get into a wide squat stance. I'm going to squat down. As I come down, I'm going to take my elbows and drive them into my knees, push those hips outwards. And then I'm gonna stand right back up again. So you really don't wanna stay down in this squat position for more than five seconds, I would say. Push out here, stand up. Let's get about five of these in total. Gonna to do a quick warm up here. And then we will hop right into our workout of the day. Ooh. All right. Last one here. All right. Next exercise I'm gonna do is going to be one of my favorites. It's a runner's lunge into a twist. So that right leg's gonna come forward. My left leg stays popped straight up here. I'm going to lean forward into that stretch here. Take that second. And now I'm going to take my right arm and open up towards the leg that's up into this lunge. Come back down. Pedal those feet back and just switch your leg. No need to go all the way standing up here. Get this first stretch in, pulling that knee over our toe. Open up, twist. Let's do one more on each leg. I like to pedal my feet back here, get a little calf stretch in. All about the full body warm up as quickly as possible. Twist open here. Beautiful. I'm actually going to stay on the ground for our next stretch. We're going to go child's pose, pulling those shoulder, shoulders back. So I'm really digging into my palms here pulling this shoulder up. I feel this all in my lat. Same thing, three to five seconds. Now I'm gonna come into that tabletop position, my right arm, and I'm just going to thread the needle, look where my hand goes. And then back to the beginning, back to this child's pose lat stretch. Rock back into it. Now we switch our needle. Left arm goes through, left shoulder drops down. Look where that hand goes through. Back to that lat stretch. Our first one is a Superman. Anyone being Superman this Halloween? All right, we're laying down flat on our stomachs. Our arms are straight out in front of us. I'm going to pull my thumbs up towards the sky and my legs are going to kick back up with me. I'm going to get this lower back right here. So I'm coming here, pulling up and then straight down. All right, exercise number two is our spider walks. Staying with that spidery theme. All right, here we go. Wrists go underneath our shoulder blades like we're in a high plank position. Now, my right arm is going to cross over top, and then my left arm straightens me out. That's one. Let me show you as I, as I go. So I'm here, right arm comes over, left hand comes underneath, that's one. Right hand over, left hand under, that's two. We're gonna go 18 total, so we'll do nine all the way to the right, and then nine all the way to the left to come back. Our next exercise is a goblet squat. So we're going to grab those weights. Oh, I'm sorry, it's not a goblet. It's called a goblin squat. It's Halloween, right, all right, right? All right, hip width apart. That weight is up by our chest. We squat down as low as we can get. Stand up, those shoulders stay back, chest stays up. Squat down, push through those heels, stand up. All right, so those are our goblin squats, our jackknives. 
coming back down to the ground. I'm going to alternate my V up here. So my left leg pops up, my right arm comes to that leg. I'm here, touch that toe, come all the way back down, then rotate left arm to right leg, back down. We'll do right is one, left is two. Uh, we have 14 total there. Staying on the ground, dead bugs. Dead bugs were here. Come up into a basically reverse tabletop. So my legs are at 90, my arms are straight up. I'm going to straighten out my left leg and my right arm goes back with it. So we're right here. Bring those back together, back to the top. Now I switch, my right leg straightens, my left arm comes back, back to the top. The whole time I'm doing this, I'm keeping my back flat on the ground. I can't push my fingers all the way through. So core is pulling that back flat to get through this motion. All right, moving on, we pop up into our deadlifts. Our deadlifts, we're going to use both weights here. We're going to have a slight bend in the knees. We start in this bottom position, stand up, and then come back down. I'm bending the knees, which is just getting those weights farther towards the ground, but I'm still using this as a hip motion. So it's not a squat. I'm hinging those hips back, chest comes flat, almost parallel to the ground, and then I stand up right there. Pull those hips forward to stand, push them back to get low. All right, our next exercise, a skull crusher. We're going to do these standing. So those weights come up. You can do this with one or two. If you have two, you just smash them together. Bring those elbows right by your ears. Engage that core and you just bring those arms straight up overhead. So we're here, bend those elbows down, straight back up. Just gonna show you here, my forearm is what's moving. This upper part of my arm does not. You can feel that tricep is staying exactly where I want it. My forearm does the motion. Our next exercise, our Walking dead lunges, yes. Roll those shoulders back. We can you do these with or without weights. I'm gonna grab my weights for these. We're going to take one step forward. Weights in our heels here. We go straight down. Then we stand up and we alternate. So now my right leg comes forward. The weight is still in my heels. And then I go straight down, pop up. I'm saying weight is in my heels. Go straight down. The tendency here is to Bring that toe, that knee right over your toe. No need to do that. When you take that step forward, step, go straight down. Now my knee is not going over my toe. I'm gonna eliminate getting any pain in that knee. Our next exercise, second to last, a devil. Have to have the devil on Halloween, right? Taking our weights. We are going to put those down on the ground. We Put, come those legs, pop those legs out. Come all the way down, basically a hand release push up. Pop up, bring those feet in, you either hop or step. And then those weights swing up to overhead if you have the range of motion. Otherwise, when you stand up, just swing those weights right out in front of you. So as I stand up, I use those legs to pull forward. And then I put those weights down. Step out, all the way to the ground, pop forward, weights come either here or weights come up all the way overhead and back down. The last exercise are going to be two laps of monster walk. So we're going to grab our band here, put it around our ankles. Keeping it around your ankles, Two laps, so that's for me going to be this way. It's gonna be about 10 steps when you look at it. So I'll show you it this way here. We get down into a quarter squat, and I'm just going to pull 
that right leg out to the side and then have that left leg follow. I say follow, I keep tension in the band the whole time. I'm never letting it get slack. So I step out, follows, that left leg now pops out, right leg follows it, and now I go out to the other side. Staying in that squat the whole time. It's gonna be about 10 steps forward, and then we'll reverse, go backwards. We'll do two laps of those. All right, this is a pyramid. So we go through all 10 exercises. When we get to the bottom, we're going to cut off our top exercise and then work through it again. So starting off, we start at 20 supermans, 18 spider walks, 16 goblin squats, 14 jackknives, 12 dead bugs, 10 deadlifts, eight skull crushers, six walking dead lunges, four devils, and two laps of monster walks. Going on our round two, we'll cut off those supermans, go through it all again. The numbers never change, just the exercises we'll get rid of. All right, beautiful. Go ahead and grab some water, and then we will jump right into our first set. All right, we're going in 10 seconds, starting with our supermans. Coming down onto the ground. Twenty reps. Ready? Here we go. Squeeze those glutes all the way up, all the way down. It's really important here to keep your eyes in a neutral position. Don't try and look up to the sky. Keep your head and eyes looking down. Twenty here. Squeeze for a second at the top. If you are following along with the workout right now, these will be our one and only set of Supermans. So let's get them in while we can. Here we go. I have three left. Spider walks are next, so we're staying on the ground. Beautiful, staying down. Remember those spider walks. So we're in that high plank position. Right arm over left. Bring those feet with you. Left arm comes out. That's one. Right arm over, left arm out. Two. Right arm over, left arm out. Three. 18 total. Making sure that we're switching our arms. So I'm doing nine with my right. All right, there's nine for me. Now I'm gonna switch. Left arm comes over top, right arm underneath. Keep those butts down, come on. Good work. Woo. All right, I'm back. Got a little far down there, but we made it. 16 goblin squats. Grab that weight, bring it up to your chest. 16, chest is up. Squat down, squat up. Really try and push those knees outwards. Drive through the heels. Go work, jackknives are next. We hop to the ground. Jack knives. We go one, two, three, four. Right? One, two. Opposite arm, opposite leg. We're on 14. Here we go. Stay 
stay on the ground. We have dead bugs. All right, dead bugs. Back is flat. Legs pop up, arms pop up. Left leg comes down, right arm comes down. Back to the beginning, that's one. There's two. This one takes a lot of concentration. Just think opposites go down together and your arms should always be up over your head. We have 12 total. Keep that back flat on the ground. Go work. Her head standing up after this one. Hitting those deadlifts. Whew. All right, deadlifts. Grab those weights. We start on the bottom. So we start here, pull up those hips, back down. My back is staying flat the whole time. Ten total. Squeeze those glutes as you stand up. Push that butt back to get down. Go work. All right, skull crushers are next. Here we go. All right, skull crushers, I'm standing up for these. Smash those weights together. Elbows are locked by ears. Arms come back and extend all the way up. Eight total. My core stays engaged for these. No arching the back. Core stays tight. Hit eight, and then we go to our walking dead lunges. All right, six lunges. Good work. Six each leg here, come on. Did I catch you right before you finished? Job. All right, devils are next. All right, here we go. Weights come down, step or hop out all the way to the floor. Pop up, step or hop in, weights come up. There's one, just four, here we go. Four, done. Woo. Put that band on, monster walks for two laps. And then we get a break already. So I'm coming all the way back here. Two laps, about 10 strides. Here we go. All right, I am reversing directions. That's one lap and I'm gonna go backwards for two. Whew. All right, there's two. Take this off. And now, grab water. We get to cross off Supermans. And we go back to the beginning. All right, 18 spider walks. Are we ready? This is our last round of spider walks. We do these now and then we're done with them. Nine to the left, nine to the right, and then we move on. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Keep those wrists underneath your shoulders. Mm. 
spiders are scary at every time of year, except for Halloween. They're really freaking cool. All right, that's just like, it's on opinion. It's just a fact. If you don't like spiders at Halloween, you need to learn how to like them. Ooh. All right, goblin squats. Grab those weights. Here we go. Weights to chest, squat down, 16 total. Chest stays up. Good job. Beautiful, all right, hopping down, 14 jackknives. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Crunch into it, come on. Good job. 14, 12 dead bugs. Legs come up. Arms go down. 12 total. Keep that back flat on the ground. Good work. Hit those 12, we stand up. Deadlifts are next. Whew. All right, shoulders up, back is flat, core's engaged. 10 total. Come on, here we go. All right, skull crushers up overhead. Smash those weights together or use one. Elbows stay tucked. Eight. And then our walking lunges. Walking dead lunges. Six each leg here. Remember, we step out, we go straight down. Beautiful. Four devils, come on, right into them. Here we go. If you can't go all the way down to the floor, just stop right here and then pop back up. Hit those four. Woo. All right, monster rocks and then we break again. And we get to take another exercise, another monster off our list, right? All right, here we go, all the way back to the end. Step out, keep that tension in the band. Stay low in those squats. Good work, backwards. Here we go. All right, beautiful. Crossing off, another exercise. Grab some water if you need it. 
We are done with spider walks. That was a good one to cross off, I know. We're going to go into our goblin squats. This is our last round of goblin squats. Are we ready? Here we go, three, two, one, goblin squats. So we have 16 here. And then we're done with these, but we gotta get through our other seven exercises. So here we go. One at a time. All right, you can only fight one monster at a time, right? So no need to think about the other eight we're gonna tackle and fight off today. Let's fight the goblins. Is that too easy? <laughs> Good job, 16. Beautiful. Drop down, 14 jackknives. Straight into them. Come on, stay with me. Staying on the ground, we have 12 dead bugs. Whew. Legs come up, arms come up. These ones are nice and controlled. Knowing the difference here between our controlled exercises, like our squats, our dead bugs, our deadlifts, and the ones that we can kind of whip through and go fast, like our jackknives. Right? Right. All right, 12 here. And then we pop up, we have 10 deadlifts. All right, there's 12 for me. Standing up. Deadlifts, grab those weights. Here we go. Remember, these ones nice and controlled. Shoulders are up, core's engaged. Coming down, chest comes to the floor. Hips pull forward to stand up. Go work. Good, skull crushers, eight. Engage that core. Eight, into walking lunges. Six, whew. Good job. All right, those devils. Here we go. Just four. I think devils are the whole reason we have a Halloween. So we have to do the exercise, right? Right, come on. There's three. And four. Oh, not rest, drop those weights. Monster walks. Put that band back on. All right, here we go. Forward, one, backwards, two. Whew. Stay low, I know it burns. These ones hurt, I'm going backwards now. Let's go. Come on, I'm with you. We're almost at a resting point. Get those extra steps in. Don't fall over your weight. All right, rest. And now, goodbye. Goblin squats, cross those off the list. Grab water, and then we start back up. 
All right. Starting on the ground, we're starting with 14 jackknives. Ready? Three, two, one. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Here we go. Crunch up into it. Come on. When you say jackknives, do you think of like a jack-o'-lantern or like a knife in the side of someone's head? A lot of different ways you can go with this. All right, 14, we go to 12 dead bugs. Back's flat, still opposite. Go work. Twelve here. All right, good. Pop up. Deadlifts. Whew. Here we go. Slight bend in those knees. Hips come back to go down. Hips pull forward. Stand up. Roll those shoulders back. Good job. 10 into those eight skull crushers. Come on. All full extension here. Eight good walking lunges. Walking dead lunges. I keep forgetting the walking dead part. Six. Let's just do six total. Cutting these down in half. So anyone not watching, I'm skipping over, missed that. We did six extra. All right, four devils. Here we go. Pop down, four devils. Beautiful, all right, monster walks to finish here. It's a good little finisher, right? I think so. On our ankles, band stays tight, we stay low. Come on. All right, go ahead and reverse. Beautiful. All right, another break. Another monster smashed. Crossing off our jackknives. All right, 10 seconds. We go. Starting with dead bugs. Get down to the floor. Last round of dead bugs, come on. Go. 12. We are going to start cruising through this now. We're down to our last six exercises. You guys are crushing it. Amazing job. Let's push through and get to smash the rest of these monsters, right? Right. Here we go. Pop up, we got 10 deadlifts. Here we go. Not rushing through these ones though, right? We're keeping our core engaged. Good job. To 10 here. 
into eight skull crushers. I have to say, Halloween is by far my favorite holiday. I think it's so fun dressing up as somebody else for the night, right? Not only me dressing up. All right, six watching, walking lunges total. Not only me dressing up, but I love seeing everyone else's costumes. I think it is so fun to see people's creativity come out and kind of like see like a little bit of their personality. Four devils. Um, it's just a fun time to like go to a nice party and see all your friends dressed up and their props and get pictures with everyone. I love it. One more here and then we hit our monster rocks. Come on. Woo. Devils, man. They're called that for a reason. All right, monster rocks. Ready? Go. Whenever I do monster rocks, because I have to put the like band over top of my shoes, it always unties my shoes. So I think after this round, I'm just gonna take my shoes off because they're completely untied. All right, dead bugs are done. We stay up. We don't even have to get on the ground anymore other than when we hit the ground on our devils. So we start on 10 deadlifts. Come on. We are almost there. We're going to cruise through this. Here we go. 10 deadlifts. I also love Halloween because it kind of just kicks off the whole holiday season that you get to spend with just your friends and your family celebrating and enjoying each other's company and I think that is an awesome thing to do. Eight skull crushers. But Halloween's my favorite. I mean, fall weather. You got bonfires, it's spooky season, pumpkin spice, everything. There's eight, six walking dead lunges. Straight down, nothing over our toes here. Weights in our heels. I love carving pumpkins and making like pumpkin seeds and banana bread and pumpkin bread afterwards. Okay, now I'm being attracted. Devils, four devils. Monster walk. I remember the start of pumpkin season. I went in to Trader Joe's, obviously, because I am basic. And I literally bought everything pumpkin. My whole cart was just pumpkin. Pumpkin creamer, pumpkin bread, pumpkin bagels, pumpkin seeds, uh, pumpkin, those cinnamon rolls. So good. Pumpkin cream cheese on top of the cinnamon rolls. All right, guys, deadlift done. Cross them off. We're gonna whip through this, all right? Eight skull crushers, here we go. Skull crushers, this is our last round. Feel the triceps, baby. Walking lunges, six. 
weight in our heels. But anyways, when I left Trader Joe's and like went to check out, the cashiers, I think, just laughed at me. Four devils, they said, oh, you like Halloween or something? You like fall? I'm like, you know what, yes. I have nothing to be ashamed of buying all my pumpkin flavors. Four. Whew. Monster walks. All right, guys, we're almost there. All right. So in my head, we're not done with this round yet, but backwards we go. We crush skull crushers, right? Um, we have walking dead lunges to start. Devils, monster walks, done, right? Walking lunges, walking dead lunges. Let's go. Even on the last round, I could not get them right. Come on, just six. Devils for four. Come on, I know this is tough. We are almost there, don't quit now. Stay with me. There's four. Our monster walks. Woo. Already back again, here we go. Stay low, get lower, squat lower. Keep that bend. Keep that tension. Good work. All right. Walking dead lunges are done. Devils for the last time. This is amazing work. Everybody, here we go. Four devils. There's one. Come on. Woo. Devils are done. You know what we got left? Two laps of our monster walks. Twice. So we're gonna stay in these, and do four laps basically, right? So this is our devils and monster walks left. Hit that reverse, baby. Stay low. Keep that tension. All right, all the way back. I got two more steps. Take a break. Devils are done. Here's our last exercise, our monster walks. Three, two, one, go. Stay low, this is it. Our last exercise of the day. Reverse, finish this lap, and then we mash all the monsters, if one will. Woo, done. Kick that out. Oh God. All right. You guys, amazing work today. Let's just do a quick cool down stretch. I'm gonna spread those legs out wide. We're gonna go down into a hamstring, coming over to our left. I hope that you had a good Halloween workout. Now you can go and eat all the candy that you want. Switch sides. If you have kids and they're going trick-or-treating, don't steal too much of their candy. If you wanna go celebrate and have a piece of pumpkin bread, pumpkin spice latte in the morning maybe after this, hit the middle for me. 
slow that breath down. Amazing work. Thank you guys for joining our Monster Mash workout. Happy Halloween.